All I want, yeah. Only love, yeah. All I say, yeah. All I want, yeah. Only love, yeah. My name is Jason Devnish, born October 30th, 1987, and I currently play for Queen's Park Cricket Club in the Super League. I Diego Martin, Trinidad. Actually started playing football when I was about six years old with Dion Lafacard, his coaching clinic. I played there until I went to school, went to QRC, and then from QRC, really kind of explore and play all over the country and meet different people. I uh, played for Jablote for a while. We did well at under 18. Played for the national and the 17 team for a little while. So it just kind of gradually progressed, but started off playing with La Fugard right in Goodwood Park. Queen's Royal College. We did very well. We won the North Zone. Uh, Intercall finals. We lost to St. Anthony's in the final, but it was great. It was a fantastic experience. We had a great team. Some players played on national team with me afterwards as well, the under 17, so it was a good experience. From a young age, they always supported everything. You know, took me to practice back home, sent me away to play football, a lot of support from everybody. So, on the football field in particular is your team and how you get along with your teammates, your relationship with your coach, and then obviously everybody kind of fighting for the same goal, everybody being on the same page and, you know, working together. My personal success is just based on the, the love of the sport. I love the sport and I always want to play it at the highest level. Uh, so, I, even though I don't play it at the highest level, whatever level I play it at, I try to play it to the best of my ability. I was very impressed. I, I thought the quality was fantastic. Every single team that we play against is a difficult game and a very competitive game. All the players are pretty much on a very equal level. I think that, that it's very competitive. Well, yeah, probably getting picked for QRC in Form 3. That was a kind of a big achievement for me to play into call at such a young age. That was kind of the biggest accomplish, accomplishment for myself at that time. Probably win any Big East Championship with my university team, University of South Florida. We won two Big East Championships. The first one, we were underdogs and came and won the entire thing. Uh, we got a nice big ring for it, so that was a great experience. We played in the final, we played against Louisville in Tampa. Dion Africa, to be honest, he. Um, that's where we kind of learned all foundation, all the important things, the skills, the discipline, and that really, that foundation really kind of took me and, you know, allowed me to, to experience a lot of the things that I was able to experience because of football. So he definitely was one of the most important figures in my football career. I, I think I like to experiment and try things sometimes. Sometimes it may not work. Uh, sometimes it works and, and it looks great, but I'm not afraid to, to try different things and to be creative and to do things some players wouldn't do. Real Madrid FC. So, Real is your favorite team. Who's your favorite player? Number 22, Esco. I enjoy watching him play. Um, he's smooth, he's skillful. I, I, if I was to be a player, I would like to be like him. Like He's very entertaining to watch, very calm and collective on the ball and very skillful. The institution is fantastic. They do a lot for their players. There's a lot of support. Obviously, the facilities are fantastic and they allow the facilities to the players, which is something that you don't get a lot of. The coaching staff and the management and everybody, they look after the players in a very, very good way. They're very open-minded. They always look to try and help players that may be less fortunate. So it's, I mean, it's, a, it's an honor to be a part of Queen's Park, to be honest. For me, it wasn't, it wasn't really a choice. It was just being a part of Queen's Park and, and choosing to play for this club and at the highest level possible. But I think it's a good idea maybe for young players who haven't reached that level to maybe start at a, a lower level, get experience playing with this type of league that may be a little bit less, a lesser level than the Pro League and then gradually build yourself up. Once you, once you are a standout performer in this league, then you graduate and you could you could always go and find another team and play at a higher level once once you think you could play at that level. Um, but I would definitely suggest a younger player start at a lower level and then work your way up. All I want, yeah. only love, yeah. all I say, yeah. 
All I want, yeah, only love, hey, yo. Hey, DJ. <laughs> 